Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to properly sterilize grain using an instant pot for making grain spawn. A lot of people think this is impossible using the instant pot because it only gets up to around 12 psi, and most traditional pressure cookers get up to about 15 psi. But I've been doing this for over a year now, and I've added um, about half an hour onto the traditional time. It's usually around 90 minutes, and I'm going for about one hour and 55 minutes. Um, this is some blue oysters that have fully colonized the grain here. And here are some chestnut mushrooms that have done the exact same. So what I've done is I've hydrated my rye overnight, and then I've cooked it on the stove, I've drained it, and let it dry. Then I've got my mason jars, I've put a couple fuel pellets in here, and I've lightly hydrated them. This way, when I inoculate with liquid culture, it, it will absorb any extra moisture in the jar. After that, I've filled it with the, the grain, placed the modified lid on top, one with an injection port and one with a breathing port, covered it with tin foil. Now it's ready to load into the pressure cooker. I've put, placed the steaming rack inside and I've filled up water just above it. We're going to put the lid on and seal it. We're going to pressure cook it for 1 hour and 55 minutes and we want the settings to be on more and high. We're going to turn off the keep warm function because we don't need that. And then after it's done cooking, we're going to let it cool for around 12 hours until we remove it from the pressure cooker. And then it will be ready to inoculate with whatever strains of mushrooms you desire. Best of luck.